beers. Three beer minimum here. Your small engine addict. Uh, also, look kind of an electronics guy. And first off, before I get into this uh, video, I want you guys to smash that subscribe button, click that like button, give me a thumbs up. Uh, hopefully this video gets some views here. And you guys are probably having trouble with, if you're watching this video, your Logitech G602 mouse. And you're having connection issues. You, you lost a dongle. You got a new dongle, whatever. You know, you, you got you got one of these little things right here. You got it in the mail. You got it from the eBay. You got it from the Amazon's. You got it from the eBay's. You ordered a new receiver for your Logitech G602 uh, mouse. And you go ahead and yeah, you read the little pamphlet that it comes with, and it tells you to. Go to Logitech.com slash downloads and download the connection utility. And you go ahead and do that. And you get this little error here. Uh -huh. da, da, da. So, let me go ahead and pull this screen here up. Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? Air right there. Okay. So, you have this here. And when you click on next... Well, sorry, I'm going to get this now. Anyway, let's just go ahead and pretend this is a screen saying, hey, click the next button. Um, and it never lights up. And you go back, you click on advanced, and under advanced, it tells you no devices found right here. Um, I have it all connected now. I will tell you how I did it because I was fighting this for about two hours. And what I finally went ahead and did is when you go to Logitech's website and you search for connection utility, there she is right there, you go to connection utility and you go show all downloads. Oh, naturally you're going to want to have download what it has here. No, that's your first problem. With some of, the, with some of these mice, the latest driver does not work. Uh, go click show all downloads. Well, I'm going to select Windows 10 here. Show all downloads. You can show all downloads. I got Windows 10 again. And go to the bottom one. Go to the one that says software version 20, you know, it's a 2.0.3. Download that connection utility. You'll notice even when you download it, you save it, the file name's different. And then when you go through um, this here, it'll say, hey, turn it on, turn it off. Once you turn it, you know, off and back on, off and back on. It might not do it for me now because I already have it working. Um, this will light up and then your mouse will work. So the issue I was having in the beginning was, uh, and I can't recreate it here to make the video, but the issue I was having, I downloaded the connection utility, I clicked next, and I plugged the receiver into my machine. It never came up with the next button. It never detected it. Go back to Logitech site, click on show all downloads, get the one at the very bottom, and start working your way up the list is what I would do, rather than working your way down. Um, I decided to start from the bottom up after I went and worked with the latest driver. Hopefully this works for you. If you have any questions, go ahead and hit me a message below. I'm really good at returning, uh, getting back to messages. Like I said, I fought this damn thing for about, I don't know, two episodes of Family Guy, uh, and two beers. And now they got it working. One more beer is going to go in a hole. Three beer minimum. I'm out.